Yeah, that's right, Shelly. The family tells me thieves it took them three hours to steal the car from this area Saturday night. Now, that race car belonged to longtime local racer Tom Malloy, who passed away last year from colon cancer. And tonight, the family is pleading to get his race car back. The need for speed. It was the fuel that drove Tom Malloy's passion for race cars. He put his heart and soul into everything he did and racing was no exception. Number 62. This is the car Malloy spent two years building. It was the last car he raced before he died from colon cancer in November. But Saturday night, thieves stole that red car and the trailer it was in. Someone knew where this car was and did everything they could to get the car in the trailer. Christine Murphy was Malloy's girlfriend. She estimates the value of the trailer to be about $30,000. As for the car. How do you put a value on two years of your life? Tom Malloy raced all over New Mexico, but here at Sandia Speedway, he was known as track champion. The car is irreplaceable. Malloy's two sons, as you can imagine, are devastated. It's one more wound in a, in a very broken heart. It's it's ripping the scab off and bleeding all over again. A lot of Albuquerque families have been in this same position. Thieves stole 7,710 cars in 2016. That's up more than 2,500 from the year before and seven times the national average. This family, like thousands of others, just wants their stolen car back in one piece. This was a family heirloom and it needs to come back to the family.